Hey guys, this is how you can tell I just woke up. My eyes are very puffy. I can barely see out of them. I would rather not work out right now, but we're going to work out right now because I don't have time throughout the day. I have a ton of aquaphor in my lips right now because I woke up crusted, dusted, and busted. It wasn't a cute sight. So I'm going to make coffee and put Bodhi outside and then we'll get our workout on. <laughs> Hello everyone, I wanted to just hop on here real quick and say don't forget to subscribe and support my channel. Right now we are at 92 subscribers and we are on our road to 1,000 subscribers. So let's keep going and don't forget to support my channel by hitting the like button and also subscribe so that you can get notified when my next videos are coming up. Thanks so much guys. Guys, let's get our first sip. Mm. This is Pike Place. It's really good. And also, oh, it looks like I have a black eye, but it's just a pimple. Okay, I got my water, my coffee. I need to see if Bodhi's done going to the bathroom. And let's go work out. Good job. Good job. That's right. Run it down. We got that right. You need to get the motor. Awesome. Round two. We're going up. Watch pretty boy with his shirt off. Okay guys, this is what I posted on my Instagram story. I post my workouts daily. So go check out my Instagram. My handle is at Jennifer Kluver to see more clips. I wanted to show you Bodhi. He's shaking so much, I'm hungry. Isn't he the cutest little thing? Make breakfast because I need to eat something. I'm starving. Okay guys, so I got my breakfast made. I got eggs with onions and mushrooms and tomatoes in there. This has been my favorite breakfast for like the last two weeks. I don't know, something about the tomatoes just makes it taste like a little bit sweeter, I guess. I really like it. And then I got my orange, I already ate half of it because I'm starving. And then we're just gonna do a dash of salt and then more pepper. And let's eat. I'm gonna work out out of the way so we can go to my brother's house for dinner and I don't have to worry about working out like really late at night. Like I'd rather just get it done with as soon as I wake up. That's why I don't even eat breakfast because it's like I just want to get it over with. And I really do enjoy it. It's just like, you know, one of those things part of your day where if you just get it done, then you can focus on the rest of your day. So I am going to Walmart because I am filming a video um, called, I think I'm going to call it Walmart Tips and Tricks, like how to eat healthy on a budget, similar to my grocery outlet one. But 
for Walmart tips and tricks. So I'm really excited about that. So I need to do that. For my brother's house, we're doing like a taco bar type of situation. So we are gonna do fajita veggies. So I also need to get like fajita stuff from Walmart. Just wondering why we buy him these dog beds <laughs> when he just sleeps on the corner of his bed. <laughs> He's so cute. I can't stand it. <laughs> Okay guys, so we're at Walmart right now and um, we had a little bit of a dilemma. So I started um, developing this rash. So I was kind of panicking a little bit because just like one should it do, I Googled my symptoms and I uh, Googled rash while on Accutane and it said could be critical. So I messaged my doctor and I called the dermatologist office, so that's why I didn't like really film after breakfast or anything because I was like dealing with that whole situation. So I'm currently waiting to see if I'm gonna die. So here's to hoping that I don't. My hair, this is my natural wave, you guys. I started doing like the curly girl method, like not all in, but kind of substituting some of my products. And I kind of just love the way it looks. Hopefully it doesn't look scraggly or anything. It is just honestly so soft. Um, and before my hair literally felt like straw and like, I don't know, I kind of like the wave. It's so low maintenance. Here, let me scoot my seat back so you can see. It's so low maintenance. It's definitely growing. Like you guys can see my roots, they're right here. I literally haven't gotten my hair done since before our wedding in September of 2020. Isn't that crazy? Like, that's crazy. So, yeah, no, I'm kind of just really liking this low maintenance. I'm trying to decide if I want to go get my hair done before we go on vacation, but we will see. We're going to go shopping, and I think Ty is on his lunch break right now, so he's going to come meet me here. So, that'll be really nice to see him, too. <laughs> Hi, baby. Okay guys, so we just got back from Walmart and I got a ton of produce and stuff. Tice is gonna make homemade salsa, so I'm really excited for that. And I also got some other things and we got some good content for the Walmart saving money tips video. So I'm really excited about that. I never realized until I was like walking back to the car and really thinking about it. And like, I really have like I just love being able to share tips and stuff that maybe other people might not know about saving money because like not everybody might have the ability to spend the money all the time or I remember when we were on a much more strict budget like when I was going to college and stuff like that and it's like not everybody might just have the budget to just go out and blow a ton of money so I really enjoy saving those tips and now that you know Tyus and I have our full-time jobs and everything and our second incomes and stuff like that so we're not on as tight of a budget, but I like we still do these tips to save money because why wouldn't you if you could? So. Dang, some people are ballsy driving through this Walmart parking lot. More ballsy than me. I wanted to tell you guys, I got a message back on my chart. Here's my rash. She says that it looks like dermatitis and she ordered a cream for me. However, I've heard that if you use the First Aid Beauty moisturizing cream that that will help. So I purposefully, when I came into town, I purposefully didn't put anything on my skin at all right here at least. Of course, I put sunscreen and moisturizer like here and here, but I didn't put it on my neck because I didn't want to aggravate whatever is going on. So maybe I was just like a little bit more worried than I should be, but I was just taking precautionary measures. I feel like when you're on Accutane, you kind of just like, you have to be careful with that stuff because you never know. You never know how your body's gonna react to something. And just because, yeah, I'm on my third, my fourth, my fourth month. Just because I'm on my fourth month of Accutane right now, like something can happen, even though like we've been doing this for four months. So something else could develop. Let's do a water check. If you're not drinking any water, you should be right now. How far are you along on your gallon? I am a slacker. Look, what a freaking hypocrite I am. I'm only to here, but don't worry guys. I'll drink all of it before bedtime. Don't you worry. 
thirsty. I'm almost to the halfway mark. Honestly, it's so easy for me to chug water. Like some people have such a hard time drinking water, but for me, like it's easy. That's why I was like, I know I'll go through this. Hello everyone, I just wanted to come on here and say that if you guys are ever in the area of Northern Nevada, you should totally check out the off-roading trails that they have. There are literally hundreds of them. There's so many different places to explore within the desert and the mountains, and there's also Tahoe. And then also there's so much beauty and architecture and history within the area. So I highly recommend, you know, getting off the beaten path if you're in Nevada and go find some trails because there's so many different things that you can do to explore here and Tyus and I had the best time on this little trip. Okay guys, I forgot to film an outro, but I wanted to say thank you so much for all your support. Don't forget to subscribe and I hope you guys have the best day. Bye!